I'm Mel Mason. I'm an electronics technician and I joined the department in 1966 uh, as part of setting up a new development team or an increased development team, especially with electronic instrumentation for geophysical instruments for the department. Seismic refraction at sea is a system whereby we use sound waves to determine a rock velocity, sound velocity of a rock. This allows scientists to determine the sort of rock that lies beneath the crust. The way that it is done is that you let off a large explosion to produce a sound source. That sound then travels through the sea but also is refracted into the rock layers and the speed at which this sound travels through the rock layers gives the scientists a, an idea of the type of rock that it is and the signals are detected by hydrophones suspended beneath sonoboys which are then sent back to the ship via radio signal but also internally recorded when the boys are out of radio range. Here we have the boy uh, ready for deployment. The aerial has been attached, the navigation light has been fitted and the hydrophone will be attached to this connector here. The boy electronics itself attached underneath this plate here is bolted into, onto the boy with a single o-ring seal to make it waterproof. Below the buoy would be a pole of similar length to the aerial with a lead weight to stabilise the buoy to keep it in the upright position. This is the lifting strop which we use for recovery. Attached to this would be a, a stray, what we call a stray line with floats that allow you to grab it, attach it, this to a lifting crane to haul it out of the water on retrieval. This buoy is number four, which means that it's channel number four on the radio receiver. Here we have the ship recorder. These are the clock traces from the ship clock up here. This is the hull geophone detecting the shot instant. And you'll see in a minute that we start to get ground waves received from the sonar boys on these two traces here. Take some time, but here they come. And then this is the direct wave travelling through the water.